This video will review how to unpost a previously posted journal entry batch. To enable this feature for a user, first navigate to System Administration, System Setups, User Groups or Users. Then select the desired user group or user. Once you're on the profile, navigate to Restrictions, Miscellaneous tab, and select the Can Unpost Tasks field. Then select Save. Please note if you don't have access to enable this feature for yourself, you will need to contact your Encore administrator. To unpost a previously posted general ledger journal entry batch, ensure that the company's fiscal period for the previously posted batch date of record is active. Then navigate to General Ledger, Journal Entries. Select the previously posted batch you wish to unpost and optionally select the View Audit Trail button to review the original Audit Trail posting archive document. Select the Unpost button in the toolbar to unpost the batch and select Yes to proceed or No to cancel the unpost process. The batch will be unposted and you can make the necessary edits. Once you're done, use the Preview and Post options to repost the batch. Note that the original audit trail number value will be retained and reused for reposted batches. To view them, navigate to General Ledger, Reports, Audit Edit Log Inquiry. In the View Logs for field, select Journal Entries. Ensure that the start date and end date are correct. Select the audit number and ensure the desired actions are selected. A new audit log inquiry has been created for you in a Step 3 View Edits tab to review any details made by users during the unpost and reposting of audit batches. You can also navigate to General Ledger, Reports, GL Inquiry, select the appropriate account, and generate. Then select a posted batch. A view edits tab has been added for you to view the edits made to unposted and reposted batches when viewing any selected amount in inquiry that was included in an unposted and reposted batch. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more how-to videos and don't forget to subscribe.